Welcome back this morning on Today Food, the one, the only Giada De Laurentiis, the famed chef and founder of the website and blog, Giadzi. Did I say that right? Yeah. That's so cute. Giadzi is here with a simple, flavorful recipe for pasta zozona. Jada, good morning. Hi. I, it has been a thousand years since we saw you in I know. person. It's How's been everything? A hot second. It's been great. It's been great. How's the fam? The fam's great. Yeah. Um, Jade started ninth grade, so I we're can't in high school now. That. Oh my gosh. So the days of like a little kid wow. are over, as you probably know well, because oh, your kids are getting older. They're getting older. Um, oh, and yeah, and so I tonight I'm gonna jet off to Italy. I'm gonna go to Rome and oh. Milan and see some, you know, farmers and some uh, families that, you know make the ingredients. I love when you go to Italy because then you come back and you've learned all kinds yes, of new stuff. Yes, and I collect stuff. all this stuff and curate it. And I already Jonesy. predicted that the tasters will have clean plate clubs right off the board. Well, let's, let's show you this how to delicious. make it then. What do we do? Okay. Pasta zazona. So I heard, I heard you, you've been cooking. Well, <laughs> that's a stretch, but no, okay. I have learned, I, I okay. can do well, a couple can, things. Can you hold a knife and chop this for me? I think so. Or do you want me to do it? How do you want it chopped? Like that. Oh. Well, it's not going to be that good. Just watch your fingers, whatever you do. I know, that's what everyone says. This is a shallot. Yes. Um, I like the shallots because they're a little bit sweeter, but you could definitely use just a regular okay. onion if you wanted to. Okay, but let's pretend I did this. Okay, that's great. Perfect. Blah, blah, blah. Oh, Throw okay, it in there. there. Okay. Okay. No, no, wait, 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 wait. I got to take the, the pancetta out. So this oh. is pancetta. So this, the pancetta this, is coming out. Wait, oh, this man. pasta is a mashup of two of Rome's classic pastas, okay? okay? Um, carbonara, which we all know is creamy. Hold on, hold yes, on. delicious. Here, dump it in there. Yeah, I was just like, okay. taking an hour. Well, usually, <laughs> usually I do this all in one okay. pan, but you know, today. Okay. Okay, great. That smells okay. good. Okay, what is this, sausage? Yeah, and this Yum. is sausage. So it's a mashup of carbonara yeah. and okay. amatriciana, both okay. Roman dishes. Okay. One is a tomato-based, and one is like sort of a creamy egg-based, okay. right? Okay, Would you so use you cook the these same together. pancetta plate, or whatever this is called, saucepan, if yeah. you normalize? Yes, so I use okay. one skillet okay. to right. do everything. That's what some I of the fat from the That's pancetta. what I was trying to articulate. Some of the fat from the pancetta cooks the onion. Yeah. I like that. Okay, because the shallot. Okay. okay. What about so this? then you can dump the rest of the shallot in here. Okay. This is great because just dump and stir for you. It's I know. It is, okay. I do like Garlic. That. Garlic. Okay. Big old whole Just clothes. have your husband prep it all for you. I and know. then you can come home and put mean, it together. Seriously. Right? Okay, wait, no, tomatoes first. Give oh, me the why? why does that matter even? So that I'm, I'm going to show you. Yes, the whole thing. So you see how smooth this is? Mm. So in, Ita in Italy, we call this a passata. Mm -hmm. So it's basically no seeds in it. Oh. It's very creamy. Yeah, and it looks... you buy it just like this. Okay, it's... it looks like ketchup, but isn't. But isn't ketchup, okay. I promise. So I'm warming this up, and then I add the spicy stuff. Yeah, so this is Calabrian chili, mm -hmm. which you may have heard of. You guys in all may have heard of it now. It's very popular these days. Delish. We're, we're too busy eating. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, yeah. sorry. Yeah. Anyway, this makes it spicy, and mm. it's going to make it really spicy, because that's a lot of Calabrian chili. Okay. But you could use red pepper flakes yeah. in place of it. But this has more of like a, a balancing, sweet, easy to find, and though? spicy. All these fancy ingredients you've got. Can we find that? Yeah, you can. Okay. Okay. On Jodzy.com. Okay, oh, moving on. Oh, yeah, oh my God. Shame move on. But you can find okay. it out other places, Now, what too. are these cute little pastas? Okay, so look at this I've little pasta. This pasta. Aren't they the cutest? So these are known as Nodi Marini. So they're from Marini. Naples. Okay. And you see they look like a little knot. I love yeah. them. Aren't they cute? Marini. They're like so little I've, donuts. I found them in Naples a few years ago, and then I started, you know, bring them back for okay. everybody to have. A little taste it. of Italy. Okay. Okay, sauce is cooking. It yeah. takes about 10 minutes, but on this burner, it might take five. Okay. Um, anyhow, so that all cooks together. So this is the tricky part right I here. did not see eggs coming. Well, because I said it was a mashup between carbonara yeah, that, okay. and a matriciana. Matriciana right. has pancetta, it's a tomato sauce, mm -hmm. carbonara, as we all know. Okay, so how does yeah. this get into it? So it got into the bowl. Oh, I no, separated no, I mean, how the eggs egg yes. get into the recipe. <laughs> yes, because it's, it's a mashup of car carbonara has eggs. Yeah, I know. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, okay. go. What, so whisk? You're, yes, you're going to break up and whisk the three yolks. Look at this, y'all. Uh, look at you whisking. See, see look how good you are, yo. I think you've learned a thing or two. I whisked. I whisked. Okay, okay, ready? So now we're going to add pecorino, half a cup. Mm. And one cup of parmigiano de Oh my gosh, now we're getting to it. Okay, so this is the trick right here. Okay. Because if you add this directly into here, Sticks. what happens? It's thick and lumpy. Well, you end, up with, you end up with scrambled eggs. Right, right, Which you don't right, want. Right, okay, right. so here we go. This is, a it's okay. this is my issue just with water. It's okay, it's okay. okay. Ready? Water yeah. Okay. Is that water Slowly, water? this is pasta water. Oh, oh, so we're using oh, it when so you cook water. the pasta, reserve about a quarter cup, mm -hmm. and you're going to use hot pasta water to break this up and create a creamy sauce slowly. So when you add this. It's really bugging me. Okay, yeah. Don't you always want to get that out of there? I don't yeah. understand. What would whisk? you do? It makes no sense. The whisk. Right? It always happens with there the whisk. Go. Okay. Totally fine. <laughs> okay. Don't take okay. it out on the whisk. It's totally fine. Okay. Leave the okay. whisk okay. alone. Okay. Okay. okay, so you're going to use this instead. Yes. And you're just oh. going to continue oh, okay. to mix it. we got to keep mixing it. Oh, okay. Mix and add. Mix and add. Mix and add. 
Okay. I'm now so glad gonna... they gave us so long for this segment. Yeah, there we go. Oh. And that's it. So that this is this oh, is now the part. we can get that yeah, in there. Yeah. So now you can get this back in there. All right, we're back to the. And works. I'm gonna add the pasta in the sauce. You remember when you had that cooking show, Samantha? <laughs> remember, it's coming back for the holidays. <laughs> oh, great. oh, ye of little faith. <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh, you guys. You should come on it, actually, Jada. Oh, I'm good. I'm good. <laughs> I'd love to. Now that you've invited, now that, you, now that you've invited me, I can come on yes. it. Okay, okay. Now what? Okay. So now look. You ready? Yeah. Okay, off the heat. So we're going to turn the heat off. Yes. You want to do this off the heat? Go ahead and add it. And then you pour it in. This is exciting. I, there I we really go. didn't see this coming in the recipe. Well, what does it go. really add to it? Just like a thicker sauce? It creates creaminess. creaminess. Go grab a bowl and taste okay, it. Okay, I will. I will. And then Let's we finish it. it. So we basically do this okay. off the heat. You got to do this yes. off the heat so you don't scramble the eggs. You just keep tossing it. And yes. the eggs get cooked by the boiling hot water. Mm. Got it. Oh, and then yummy. the heat of the pan. This is so good. Oh, good. See, you look good, good, good. What is, good. What is that? Then a little bit of pancetta to finish oh, it off. Pancetta. Mm. Did you want to taste? No, I'm glad. I'm glad. <laughs> oh, yeah. That is so yummy. Mm. And then a little bit more cheese to finish okay. it. And we're done. Okay. Pasta de Zona. Dotty Marini. Jonna, thank you. But wait, you think more. I could do this? <laughs> you got it. She's back in our third hour with a creative spin on a lasagna Jeez. and a delicious Italian mm. dessert. You can get Giada's recipes and more at today.com/slash food. Giazzi, thank you for coming. We Don't love you. Me.